Hello everyone. Welcome to this electronic circuit simulation series using Samuel ID. So in this particular series we'll study how we can simulate the digital electronics or maybe electronics experiments using this Samuel ID simulator. This is a free simulator available in Windows, Linux, etc. So this is the first tutorial and in this case we will study how to download this and uh, some basics about the interfaces of uh, Samuel ID. So let us go. Now in order to download this particular software we will just google here Samuel ID and we get this so many number of links I will just click on downloads if I click on downloads we come to this particular page so here we can see uh, some stable versions are mentioned this is the this one is the old version and this is the new version so when I'm recording this particular video this is the version which I'm getting so based on what operating system we are using whether Windows 64 Windows 32 or Linux 64 or Mac OS we'll click on this I'm using Windows 64 I'll just click here so when we click here we get this particular page so it is asking us to contribute if you don't want to contribute I'll just just zero okay zero and then I want this just click here so now this is what we have uh, we are given okay. so we have to type the email id so if we type that email id so i'll just type my email id and get so it will just rewrite us next we need to check our inbox as you can see I got this mail Samuel ID I just click on this and here uh, view content I'll just click on this view content and so here it will uh, I will get the download as you can see in my downloads folder uh, the file will be downloaded I'll just show it so as you can see I, I, I'll get the file in my download folder it's not showing here but uh, as you can see this this is the file which I got this is the I downloaded twice so this is the required file so show in folder so this is what we get I done it thrice so these are the files now next what I do I just uh, cut the file the zip file which I downloaded from the download folder to any suitable folder and this is what we does this is the file which you get from the download and I will this is because zip file I just extract it so extract here so it will be extracted here the file will be extracted so this is what we get now we double click on here and this is the software which we are looking for Samuel ID you just double click on this so this is what we get after clicking on that particular soft that, that particular exe file now here this is the one we will be working on so here you can see there are uh, three panels this is the left one the center and the right panel now in the left panel we have the various components these are the various components as we have the meter in which we have probe voltmeter amp, amp meter okay. uh, current meter that is frequency meter and so on and then we have sources the fixed voltage source the the clock wave generator and there are many other sources the ground and then we have the switches push switch then uh, switch then DIP switches the relay the keypad then here we have the resistors then we have active components like rectifiers in rectifiers we have diodes, zener diode, SCRs so here the transistors we can even work with MOSFET and BJTs and we have other active components the op-amp, operational amplifier, we have the voltage regulators, we have analog multiplexer and so on and then outputs we have the LEDs different types of LEDs, the seven segment displays and there are so many options are available so even here we have the different types of displays which can be used and here we have the motors in case we have the DC motors, the stepper motor, the servo motor and we have the audio output and one more thing here uh, the very speciality is that we can also work with AVRs the PIC microcontrollers different types of PIC microcontrollers then 8051 okay and then we have the Arduino so Arduino is uh, this UNO, Mega, Nano and so on and the shields LCD shields and digit shield and of course there are some sensors as you can see uh, the this sensors is a temperature sensor and we can even have this other sensors uh, then there are various peripherals as you can see serial port 
then rotary encoder the touchpad and here there's the, the basic gates the AND gate OR gate the arithmetic circuits memories in which we have flip-flops okay uh, the various converters that multiplexer demultiplexers so there are where even we have this uh, ICs the 7400 series and you can see there are so many number of components which are available so this is on the left side left panel on the right panel we have the canvas where we actually construct the circuits now suppose I, I want to place some components like I want to place the LED I'll just click here and just uh, drag and drop okay this is the LED and then this is the seven segment I can just put it here if I want to connect this it's very easy I just put the bring the cursor here left click and it gets connected here okay sorry so it gets connected then uh, we can select any so the main working area is this one this is the selection part on this right side we have the compilers in case if you want to program write a program for take an example of Arduino or any other uh, microcontroller we will write it in this particular area so this is where we compile and debug the program so this is the short tutorial which we shows the uh, how to use this ID how to download and how to use this now in the coming uh, tutorials we'll see how we can construct some very basic circuits so that's all for this particular session thanks for watching